everyone, welcome back. Nate here with 911 Rapid Response. And on today's vehicle showcase, we have for you a purchase ready Ford F-150 police responder. And we can start by going over the aftermarket equipment that we have installed here. This vehicle was upfitted for police use. As you can see, high up in the visor, we have the Whelan Inner Edge FST. This is a duo model, so we'll get white function out of that. Flash in flood. At the front, we have the Weston push bumper. And this is the public safety model. So integrated in the top channel, we have two wheel and ions, I'm sorry, four wheel and ions, two blue, white, two red, white. So we'll get flash and flood out of those as well. This vehicle is equipped with wheel and Sencom core. On the center rail there, we have a, a flood lamp. And on either side of the push bumper, we have a wheel and T-ion duo red blue. Moving along to the side of the vehicle, on the fender we have the wheel and Argus. This is a remote controlled spot lamp. On the fender we have a surface mounted wheel and T-ion red blue. Down low at the runners we have wheel and tracer these are six lamp models so specific to the ford f-150 uh, you can put a five lamp on here and mount it with the universal l bracket but we have the vehicle specific brackets here and for that application it calls for a six lamp tracer we'll get white flash and flood out of that as well rear quarter wheel and ti on red blue and we'll move around to the rear of the vehicle we have the wheel and inner edge RST for the F-150 in the rear glass. Taillight flashers are active. And just below the hatch, we have the wheel and T-ion surface mounted there for those two red, white, two blue, white. We'll get some white reverse functionality out of that or rear seam. Other aftermarket additions, we added the Back Industries backflip. This is a tri-folding hard tonneau cover. Uh, solid piece of equipment here and that's going to keep the weather out of the bed. We also have a deck unit inside here, two drawer system, still leaving some storage space in the bed above here. We can strap things down. We got ammo cans on either side and we have the, the weatherproof drawers here. Furthermore, prisoner containment, pro guard equipment. We have a recess panel partition, steel window bars, plastic door panel replacements, and we also have the plastic rear window guard, uh, which our RST is mounted to. And for console additions, we have the Havis vehicle specific console here. It's a large unit, wide console. Actually has a map book or map pocket there on the right hand side. We have our wheel and Sencom rotary and slide control head. And we also have our wheel and Argus spotlight control there just below it. Small accessory pocket, side mounted armrest, and we do have the addition of one gun lock there in the recess panel. All right, folks, now for some functionality here in this F-150. Um, right now, we're currently in a slide two position. We don't have any white lighting or uh, slide three in park. If we go into slide three, we're gonna get our white flashing active. This is gonna be the front and the side of the vehicle. So white flashing, headlight flashers, ions in the grill, and our FST, and we also have white flashing in our tracers. We can see that we also have some front flood tech, uh, front flood takedown or alley lighting. We have a multi press front scene button. And we also have our wheel and Argus. This thing is pretty impressive. Responsiveness is very nice. There's a lot of concern there, but uh, as far as this thing being too touchy, anything like that, it works just great. 
and back to home. At the rear of the vehicle, we have our traffic, traffic advisor functions in the RST, so overriding amber there. And also around the vehicle, we have a DVI function. I know it might be a little hard to see in the daylight here, but uh, we do have the DVI functionality around the vehicle for nighttime operation in park. And that'll wrap up this vehicle showcase of uh, our Purchase Ready F-150. We appreciate you following along. Make sure you stay tuned. We have plenty of vehicles to come, staying really busy around here. If we can help you out with anything, please give us a call at 717-473-3843. Thanks, y'all, and we'll see you next time.